Welcome, fellow adventurers, to the ultimate must-have new Skyrim mods for August 2023. In this month's showcase, we bring you the most incredible and game-changing mods that will elevate your Skyrim experience to new heights. From immersive gameplay tweaks to breathtaking visual enhancements, we've got it all covered. So, sharpen your swords, prepare your spells, and let's dive into the boundless world of Skyrim modding. Allow me to introduce the first mod, Gourmet, a cooking overhaul. Gourmet is a comprehensive overhaul of Skyrim's cooking system, reimagining the distribution of food, ingredients, and crafting tables throughout the game. Not only does it extensively revamp cooking recipes, but it also rebalances the inventories of all food vendors, such as innkeepers, general merchants, grocers, butchers, and brewers. Furthermore, new recipe items, cookbooks, and chef merchants have been introduced, along with new drinks and drugs. In Gourmet, consuming food grants long-lasting buffs to health, magicka, or stamina regeneration. Meats and stews offer health regeneration, vegetables, soups, and breads provide stamina regeneration, while pastries, desserts, and cheeses boost magicka regeneration. All food buffs last for 20 minutes by default, and players can benefit from all three buffs simultaneously. When it comes to alcohol, Gourmet bestows a long-lasting buff to either stamina or magicka, but at the cost of an equal debuff to the opposite stat. Aleish and Meads increase stamina while reducing Magicka, and Wines and Brandies increase Magicka while reducing stamina. Alcohol is available in two tiers, Common and Rare. Common alcohol increases one stat by 25, while Rare alcohol increases one stat by 50. In Gourmet, becoming a vampire or a werewolf has a negative impact on one's ability to benefit from food. Food buffs are approximately 50% weaker for vampires, while food buffs last half as long for werewolves. These debuffs are visibly reflected in the player's active effects. Furthermore, Gourmet integrates seamlessly with survival mode, introducing hot foods distribution, new hot food recipes, and buffs to the hot foods themselves. The mod also alters the distribution of Restore Hunger effects to align harmoniously with Gourmet's gameplay mechanics. Next up, we're diving into the immersive world of Skyrim with the amazing Immersive Death Cycle mod. If you've ever felt that the game lacked realism and environmental storytelling when it comes to dead animal remains, then this mod is an absolute must-have. The Immersive Death Cycle mod takes realism to a whole new level by simulating the natural decay process of dead animals. No more static animal corpses lying around indefinitely. Now, as you venture through Skyrim's wilderness, you'll witness the gradual decay of these creatures, adding life and dynamism to the game world. Picture this. Four hours after an animal's death, you'll notice the carcass looking half-eaten and half-decayed. But wait, there's more. Twelve hours later, all that will remain are the bones, creating a natural progression of decay that brings the world to life. But the benefits don't stop there. For all you necromancers out there, the mod enhances your undead army experience. Raised creatures now have custom decayed models, perfectly fitting their summoned state. They'll even trigger the half-eaten slash half-rotten models, adding an extra layer of immersion and detail to your necromantic endeavors. Immersive Death Cycle will be a must-have mod for players who value immersion. Besides, this mod is incredibly lightweight and doesn't modify any vanilla game files, guaranteeing stability and compatibility with other mods. You can easily integrate it into your existing Skyrim adventure without any hassle. Next, let me introduce you to the Seamless Varied Masculine Idols OR mod. This mod, created by Sonderbane, adds new idol animations specifically designed for male characters. With incredibly smooth and natural animations, this mod includes eight new seamless varied masculine idols. Leveraging OAR's randomized loop swapping features, it offers two main idols, three miscellaneous idols, and three mirrored alternates of various lengths, all seamlessly meshing together without any player input. This effectively reduces repetitive idols, ensuring a more immersive experience. Both male NPCs and male players can benefit from these animations, providing a cohesive and realistic feel to the game's male characters. Moreover, through Saunders' keyword distribution resources, elder NPCs can be restricted from using these animations, allowing you to allocate these unique animations exclusively for players, if desired. Next, let me introduce you to the D-Menu mod. The D-Menu mod is a simple menu, intended to be a replacement for the Add Item menu. I confirm two major functions, 
Firstly, weather and time editing. Similar to the Createe mod, D menu allows you to edit the weather and time in the game. You can instantly select the desired time or weather conditions of your choice. Secondly, the add item function. D menu allows you to quickly obtain items from the mods you are using. This feature is similar to other mods like the add item menu, but by using D menu, you can reduce the number of ESP plugins you have. Although D menu is supposed to have MCM like functionality, it didn't work for me. I will let you know if this part is further confirmed. D menu is an ESP free SKSE plugin, and its only prerequisite is the address library for SKSE plugins, making it a lightweight mod. To trigger the menu, simply press the Home key, and with the installation of additional fonts, it provides support for some other languages as well. Next, let me introduce you to the Immersive Interactions for Quick Loot mod. The Immersive Interactions for Quick Loot mod enables the looting animations from Immersive Interactions to be used while using Quick Loot. This feature works for NPCs, animals, and containers. For players who have been using Quick Loot but felt inconvenience due to the lack of Immersive Interactions Quick Loot animations, this mod will provide a solution. Now you can enjoy the Immersive Looting experience even with Quick Loot enabled. Next, let me introduce you to the Stand Still and Race Menu OAR mod. The Stand Still and Race Menu OAR mod is an idle animation replacer for Race Menu that keeps your character standing still during character customization. It is conditioned with OAR to automatically overwrite any other overly animated idle animations you might have added for your character. Additionally, the Still animation is disabled as soon as you exit Race Menu. If you've ever experienced the frustration of your character moving around while using the Show Race Menu Console command, making it difficult to customize your character, then this mod is the solution you've been looking for. With this mod, you can easily and conveniently customize your character without any unwanted movements. The Witchy Wings Pack is a comprehensive mod that offers a wide selection of 53 different pairs of static wings. These wings are designed as accessories that can be attached to your character, enhancing their appearance and making them look more mystical and ethereal. The mod provides a diverse range of wing designs, ensuring that you'll find the perfect match for any outfit you choose to wear. Whether you want angelic, demonic, feathery, or intricate wing styles, this mod has you covered. Wings are not just a cosmetic addition in this mod. They also provide a sense of fantasy and immersion to your gameplay. Whether you're role-playing a celestial being, a mythical creature, or a powerful sorcerer, the Witchy Wings Pack adds an extra layer of charm and intrigue to your adventures in Skyrim. The mod is thoughtfully crafted to ensure compatibility with other outfit and character customization mods, making it seamless to integrate into your existing load order. Furthermore, it's optimized for performance, ensuring a smooth gaming experience without sacrificing visual quality. Next, let me introduce you to the Ellie Love Potion Outfit mod. The Ellie Love Potion mod offers a craftable 3BA BHUNPV4 supported armor, perfect for players who desire a witchy vibe or wish to embrace the role of a sorceress. This outfit comes in six stunning colors, black, blue, Halloween, patchwork, fire, and purple. The unique feature of this outfit lies in the depiction of the top and the hat's end, resembling charred edges as if touched by flames adding a captivating highlight to the overall design. Additionally, the hat perfectly complements the witchy aesthetic. The stockings are skillfully designed to accentuate the contours of your character's legs, ensuring a flattering appearance. Rest assured, this outfit is bound to win your heart with its delightful charm and enchanting aura. Thank you for watching the ultimate must-have new Skyrim mods in August 2023. I hope you enjoyed discovering these amazing mods that will enhance your Skyrim experience. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more exciting mod showcases and gaming content. Feel free to leave your comments and suggestions below. Let us know which mods you liked the most or if there are any other mods you'd like us to feature in future videos. Stay tuned for more updates and mod showcases, and until next time, happy gaming and modding!